Great to have you with us, everybody, live on 2K Sports. Our broadcast team tonight, on one side, Greg Anthony. On the other side, Steve Smith. On the sideline, David Aldrich. I'm Kevin Harlan. You take a look at Las Vegas. This has been a tough stretch of games for them, fellas, losing their last four. Yeah, and they've just looked sort of lost out there lately. You, you know, uh, they're not playing with a whole lot of purpose or drive, and you just can't wait for good things to happen. You've got to make them happen. Here are the starters for Las Vegas. They've got Okongwu, and it's Stewart in at the center. Holiday, the pass to Stewart. Finney Smith kicks to Bembry. Some nice passing by Las Vegas here. Shot clock at five. Here's Stewart. Ball's knocked loose. The force with the ball. Here's Okongwu. It's blocked. We're about one minute into the first. Now here is Holiday. Pass to Finney Smith. Here's Stewart. Can't hit that one. That's a surprise. I mean, really out of character for him to miss when the defense is knocked right up on him. Really, the defense is helpless to stop a layup right there. Just too much of an advantage in terms of the mismatch. Now here is Holiday. To the middle. Stewart misses. Four shots, four misses. And you can sense a certain frustration building. Nader's shot's good. This is who you want leading that play. A sure passer with great awareness. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions. Right now, they need a basket. And it's McConnell with the ball. He'll bring it up for Pittsburgh. Pass to Nader. Here's Dotson. Trains the three-pointer. Dotson's got five. They have really found a rhythm here early. Four for five to start this game. Then breathe the pass to Holiday. To the inside, Stewart. And there's a nice one-handed slam. And didn't do anything fancy there, but didn't need to. Nope. He, his only concern right now is getting the points on the board. And I, I don't mean style points. Here's Nader. Pass to McConnell. Here's Melly. Nader's shot's good. This is as good as it gets for a first quarter in terms of shooting the basketball. The pass to Bembry. Back to Holiday. Here's Finney Smith. No points in the game yet for him. Let's it go from deep. Holiday gets the bucket. Now that's a high percentage look when the D doesn't fight over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. Now, here's McConnell. Nader the pass to Purtle. Pass to McConnell. The three. But they'll get another chance. Passes it to Dotson. Here's Nader. No good on the three. Las Vegas trails by four. And he's going up for the alley-oop. And Okongwu slams it in. Chemistry at its best. An unreal alley-oop. Yeah, you're right. The pass, the catch, the dunk. All of it perfect. Nader the pass to Melly. Here's Dotson. He's got five. Here's Nader. And it's blocked. And here's the fast break. Here's Dotson. Nails the corner three. Dotson's got eight points. Here's Holiday. Pass to Stewart. Down low. Keeps it alive. Trying to attack the heart of that defense with great teamwork. Pittsburgh leading by three. The pass to McConnell. Back to Dotson. Three, 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 three. 
Pass to McConnell. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Nader. Got it. And he's now three for five from the field. Shots are just flowing to him right now, having a really strong quarter. Here's Bembry. And the layup's good off the glass. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Passes to Dotson. Inside. And it's blocked. Here's Finney Smith. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. That ties the game. Holiday's got a pair of threes now in the first quarter for Las Vegas. And that's exactly what he's looking for, draining the triple. A guy who just continues to earn more minutes. You know, Finney Smith is tough, and Greg, he is effective. Uh, he seems to become a better rebounder every year. More efficient. He'll take charges, commits hard fouls. And I don't think we've seen his ceiling. Finney Smith is a guy you can win with. Now here is Holiday. He's got six. Pass to Okongwu. Here's Finney Smith. Here's Stewart. He's covered by McConnell. Stewart passes to Benbury. And that won't go, missing the go-ahead bucket. A force with the ball. Dotson kicks to McConnell. The pass to Nader. Here's Melly. Pass to Nader over Holiday. The shot by Nader, no good. No doubt it's been a bit of a struggle for him here in this quarter in terms of scoring. Holiday time out, time gets out. the bucket. He is in a time zone out. right now. Every three he puts up seems to be going down. And the force call their first time out of the game. game for the fours it was a loss to the Pelicans passes it to Dotson here's Nader trying to get something going and foul on the shot so he'll get a chance at the line nice work to get it inside and draw the contact Pittsburgh shooting their first free throws of the game two shots Shooting two. First one falls for him. That one falls, so he hits both of them. And here's Holiday, who will bring it up for Las Vegas. There's the dish to Bradley. They get it again. Shots good by Gafford. And the D getting out work there on the putback. Can't let that happen. For some reason, blocking out has become a lost art, and that's the result you'll get. Now, here's McConnell. Pass to Nader. Feeds to Pirtle. Oh, and he plucks it off the glass. Wow. On the wing, Holiday. Gafford passes to Holiday. Pittsburgh pulls it in. McConnell scanning the floor. 
the pass to Perda. And he could not get that one to go. A lot of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. It's going to be on Avery Bradley. Really like the work inside from Perto, using his body well to draw the contact on his way up. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. No oh, good on that one. What you love about Jacoperto is his size. A seven-footer who plays hard on both ends of the floor. And he's good on the second. And here's Holiday. Nine points in the game so far. That one falls. Holiday's got 11 points. And they're forcing the ball inside, and it's working like a charm. Pass to Dotson. Now, Pirtle. Another shot, and it's good on the way up. At the end of the day, when the ball goes up, there's no substitute for effort. And Holiday kicks to Anderson. Bobbed up there for Anderson. Good open look. Avery looking poised with the ball in his hands, making decisions. Pittsburgh trails by four. Down low. Here's Melly, and he stuffs it. What a pass to set him up. Oh, fellas, that was vicious. Two-hand monster slam. Guys, I don't think there was anyone who could have stopped him on that one. For Pittsburgh, they've shot 75% at the line tonight, going three for four. And Las Vegas making a change here. Wilson's checked in. And here's Las Vegas. Left side, Bradley. Steve the days of Avery Bradley being a scorer are probably over. I mean, he scored in the mid-teens, we know that. But now I think they value his defense as much as his scoring. You're right, Kevin. Avery Bradley will rely on his athleticism, especially to get to the rim to score. With his injuries and change in situation, the chances, they just haven't been there. But he's still an effective player. We just won't see his scoring outbursts as often. And he can't get the first one. A lot to like about Avery Bradley's game. Terrific on ball defender. Solid spot up shooter. And will get you some boards as well. He hits the second from the line. McConnell with it. Passes it to Dotson. Back to McConnell. Pass to Nader. Five to shoot. Shoots over Brent. And again, it's Pittsburgh missing. You know, we talk a lot about scoring efficiency. He's displaying the exact opposite. Can't tie it up as that one's no good. A for effort, but when there's that much resistance at the rim, better find another option. Yep, it counts. And when they've gone to him, he has come through big time. You got to keep getting him touches. And the pass to Nader. Here's Dotson, guarded by Holiday. Dotson can't hit. Las Vegas leading by four. Three on three. Gafford misses. Well, that alley-oop attempt, a case of what could have been, just didn't finish the play. You know, this is something you practice over and over again. I'm surprised they couldn't execute. Back right after this. Just tuning in, the second quarter of action is where we're at right now. And from what we've seen from Las Vegas so far, guys, what are you seeing? 
Like, why take jump shots when you can get your points at the rim? Especially at the start, you want to get something positive going and establish your rhythm. And here's Holiday, who will bring it up for Las Vegas. They lead by four. And a chance here presented by Gatorade to see who's on the floor. All fueled up and ready to go for the start of the second quarter. On the court right now for Las Vegas. Anderson is out there with Wilson. Then there's Bradley. And it's Gafford in at the foul. Offensive rebound. The kick out to Holiday. Here's Bradley. And all around the rim that time before dropping in. And Las Vegas leads by six. Bradley has put in a lot of work developing his offensive game, and the efforts paid off. Here's Nader, defended by Anderson. Shot clock at six. Here's Dotson. The force keeping it alive with a fresh 14. Here's Nader, defended by Anderson. From deep, Avery Bradley pulls it in. Well, he was in rhythm, hitting two threes in the opening quarter, but hasn't made one since. The basket counts and one. He'll go to the line with a chance to make it a three-point play. A good board there, but overall they're getting slightly out-rebounded. For Las Vegas, they've gone one for two on the night so far from the line. Membry's checked in for Las Vegas. That one misses. Pittsburgh trails by eight. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. Here's Nader. He's got eight. Pass to Dodson. McConnell with it. Pittsburgh working the ball around. Here's Pirtle. And again, it's Pittsburgh missing. And even with good coverage defensively that time, he has confidence to drill the three. Embry misses. Here's Dotson. Passes it to McConnell. To the inside. Ellie. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. That's his second personal foul. For Pittsburgh, they've gone four for five from the charity stripe in this one up to now. Two shots. Shooting two. First free throw is good. And so he makes both from the line. Las Vegas leading by six. And for those of you just joining us, we're almost two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Bradley passes to Gaffer. And let's check out a breakdown looking at some of the stats for him. And this is his second trip to the line tonight. Shooting for Las Vegas. Two shots. He misses the free throw. Good on the second free throw. Now McConnell. And we're now a little over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Back to Dotson. And the dunk to finish it off. A beauty. 
And once he gets clear off the screen, there is no stopping him. <laughs> no, not when there's a flush waiting to happen. That's a big-time move and a big-time finish. Here's Bembry. Gafford passes to Wilson. Clock at four. Here's Bradley. The shot is good. It's his second bucket in five tries. And this is what Avery likes. It's where he feels most comfortable, the in-between area. Pass to Dotson. Here's Nader. Back to Dotson. It's rebounded by Las Vegas. Gafford's got rebound number seven for him tonight. A slight advantage for them in the rebound department, but that oftentimes is all it takes. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. And there's the pass to Dotson. Now here is Pirtle. Back to Dotson. And the powerful one-handed slam. Strong move to the 10, trying to get his guys going. Hard not to get motivated, G.A., right when your teammate makes that kind of play. The problem is your opponent is making big plays as well. I'll be curious to see the response. Gafford passes to Anderson. And he banks in the layup. Anderson's got six. Way to convert through contact, Kyle, with excellent body control. Here's Dotson. He's got 12. Teardrop shot, and the layup is up and in. Dotson's got six in the quarter. That's nice work stopping short of the rim. Just laying it over the top. And first time out of the game called for Las Vegas. Stewart's checked in for Daniel Gafford. Okongwu comes in for DJ Wilson. And it's Justin Jackson in for Kyle Anderson. Bradley passes to Stewart. Here's Bembry. Pass to Stewart. Las Vegas needs to get off a shot. Bembry misses. They better clear a spot on the bench for him because that's where he's headed if he continues to take shots like that. Yes, he is definitely going to the bench and maybe to the locker room. Now here is Purdy. Pulls it up. And too long on the shot. And he's frustrated. That's a shot he can make in his sleep. Here's Bradley, and he'll shoot free throws here. Clearly fouled on that shot that time, the whistle blowing. And that's going to be a foul on Pittsburgh. I like the awareness of Avery. Understands he has the defender a little out of position. Takes full advantage. Free throw good from Bradley. Yeah, nice job of drawing the contact and creating opportunities at the line. He hits both from the strike. We know the NBA is looking to get rid of the one-and-done rule pretty soon. Adam Silver, Greg, saying he thinks the league can create a better system. Do you think so? I think he can. they can create a better system for some. Um, 
I, I think the growth of the G League, no doubt, it is instrumental in that new system. Uh, now these young rookies can get the playing time in lower tier pro games as they continue to develop. But I think still the collegiate game plays a significant role. The experience of going to college, even for a year, uh, can be invaluable. There are, there are pros both ways, college or the G League. Agree? I, I do. I'm just glad it's not a one-size-fits-all proposition. Now you have the option. Not every kid wants to go to college and have that experience. And he could tell his guys were dragging a little bit, calling time out to kind of let them catch their breath. Let's check out the Eastern Conference standings now that we're in the new year. You look at the force, they're right now in the eighth spot in the conference here in the early part of the season. You know, right now for Pittsburgh, they had much bigger things in mind when the season started. They didn't think of themselves as a middle-of-the-road club, but right now, that's where they are. I thought this might happen. Confidence can take you a long way, but you also have to have the talent to back it up. And he lobs it up toward the rim. In transition, here comes Pittsburgh. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. And you know what? Very close to a three-point play right there. For Pittsburgh, they put up good numbers at the charity strike, converting six of seven. T.J. McConnell. At the line Super for two. two. The first one falls. And getting to the line and hitting your free throws, a, a good way to get back into the game. It stops the clock and extends the game and allows you the opportunity to set your defense. They've been perfect from the line so far here in the second quarter. He's perfect from the line this time. Las Vegas leading by five. Then breathe the pass to Jackson. Okongwu, great positioning on the putback. Another rebound hauled in. They're hitting the glass with a lot of passion. To the middle. Okongwu grabs the board. Okongwu's now got his fifth rebound in this one. Jackson kicks to Bradley. Passes to Bembry. Some nice passing by Las Vegas here. Floats one. And Pirtle pulls it down. And the truth is, this league would have been much bigger had he shot better. Pass to McConnell, to the paint, and the dunk by Pirtle. It doesn't take much for Pirtle to throw it down. At seven feet tall, all he has to do is be near the hoop. Jackson with the bounce pass. Bradley, no one around him. His three-pointers off the mark. Pittsburgh trails by five. McConnell passes to Purdy. Here's Dotson. Now the pass to Melly. Just five on the clock. It's up a three. Eight for 15 with that made basket. But he's not satisfied yet. It's first triple of the second quarter. Third of the game. Bembry inside and it's Melly with the rebound Melly's got nine rebounds now tonight well I'll tell you what he's gonna buy himself a ticket to the bench if he keeps shooting it like that he has been putrid here this quarter playing with high energy outworking the defense up the floor and I just love it when the fast break results in a high percentage look not always the case these days this is his first trip to the line tonight. Shooting for Las Vegas. Isaiah Stewart taking two shots. And he makes the first. So for Las Vegas, Dorian Finney-Smith's checked in for DeAndre Bember. And Aaron Holliday's subbed in for Bradley. And 
that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Boy, he's got a great stroke from the line. That's not something we can say about all the league's big guys. Pass to Pirtle. Here's Dotson, guarded by Jackson. Dotson, the pass to Melly. Got a piece of it, and he's able to get it back. And a chance now to look at the schedule for the force. On Thursday, they'll take on Marc Gasol and the New York Knicks. And then on Friday, they'll head home to take on the Charlotte Hornets. Take a break. And, take you know, break. nobody loves Lisa. playing on the road, but it does offer a good chance to see exactly what your team is made of. This team is going to find out a lot about itself over the next stretch of games. First free throw is good. Both good from the line that time. And love how he's getting himself to the line this quarter. If he keeps it up, it'll end up creating some foul problems on the other side. And that can always help a team's call. Las Vegas again missing. And Pittsburgh with the possession here. Here's Nader. And so it looks like Pittsburgh will retain possession here. Still first ball. How about that strong defensive performance for this half's mobile one block? And read the plate perfectly. Gets himself in the air at the right moment. Terrific denial. Here's Dotson. Guarded by Jackson. Dotson the pass to McConnell. Down low. Pirtle. Just doesn't seem to have it here in the second quarter. And trying for the go-ahead basket, it doesn't go in. Passes it to Stewart. Tries again. Out of bounds. Possession goes to the force. Yeah, just not on the same page. Unfortunate, wasted possession. And it's McConnell with the ball. He'll bring it up for the force. Pass to Dotson. Back to McConnell. It's deflected. And here's Holiday. He's got 13. And Okonwu has it in the corner. 11 feet away. That one wide left. I tell you what, the defense should send Christmas cards for that miss. To the middle, here's Nader. Some solid defense there from Jackson. Get that weak stuff out of here. That's embarrassing. As soon as he had the ball in his hands, he put the pressure on the defense and found the opening. There's the pass to Nader. Back to McConnell. 56 seconds left to play here in the second quarter. The game has been very close in a lot of areas, but rebounding has been the one differentiator thus far. Great player movement, great ball movement. That's fun to watch. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. Back to Dotson, and he takes the feed in stride and slams it home. Never a bad idea to run the old pick play. Uh-uh, you're right. And if it produces a slam like that, we'll probably see more of them. Especially if the defense is going to allow you to do it. Have to switch on that play. And Okongwu slams it in. And how about the incredible timing on that alley-oop? He absolutely hammered it down. Here's Dotson. Cloak loose. Right wing. Here's Pirtle. So that'll be it for the first half. Fairly even battle underway in this one. Las Vegas leads by four. We'll see you after halftime for the beginning of the third quarter. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, folks, welcome back. Ernie Johnson alongside the Jet. That's Kenny Smith. The Diesel, that's Shaquille O'Neal. A lot of big-time action so far in this one. Checking out Las Vegas. Kenny, what's your viewpoint? Well, they should have a lot of room on the perimeter in the second half because they've already have a lot of points in the paint. And the D will have no choice 
chance but to collapse and try to put it in on that end. So, if you want to use the three-point shot more, they'll have the space to do it. And big fella, let's get your thoughts on the home team. They didn't put everything they had to their defense, I'll say that. They allowed a shooting percentage of over 50%. That's a bad sign. Something they can't allow again in the second half. And that'll do it for us. The third quarter about to begin with Kevin Harlan standing by. We'll catch you on the flip side, my brother. Second half of basketball upon us. We may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game it's been so far. Las Vegas leading by four. We've got T.J. McConnell, and it's Nader in its small forward. Here's Holiday. That one doesn't drop. So Pittsburgh will take it the other way. And for Las Vegas, they've got Bembry, and it's Finney Smith in at the three slot. Oh, just solid on the one-handed slam. And guys, when it's a tight ball game like this, he's the guy they want with the ball. And there's Okongwu. That's good on the assist by Holiday. Holiday's got his sixth assist on the night. Pass to Nader. Back to Dobson. Here's Nader. Pass to McConnell. Five on the clock. Shoots. Dodson can't hit. To the inside. Okongwu. And how about breaking out the Statue of Liberty on that dunk? <laughs> a nice way to pad that lead a little more. You're right. Pass to Dotson. Now, here's McConnell, guarded by Holiday. Pittsburgh working the ball around. To the middle. Here's Dotson. It's rebounded by Las Vegas. Just over a minute and a half had passed here in the third quarter. No. Oh, inflicting some punishment with the two-hand flush. Ah, they're going for the throat. The pass to Dotson. Here's Nader. Down low, uncovered. Dotson gets the bucket. Dotson's got 23 points. Important points there. Got him on a nice play, getting the ball inside and right to the bucket. And if you let the little guy get airborne before you slide over to block him out, he can and will embarrass you on the boards. Yeah, terrific play right there. Great strength to finish through the contest. For Pittsburgh, they've shot 10 of 11 at the line. Nice work so far for them. Daniel Gafford's checked in for Las Vegas. DJ Wilson comes in for Okongwu. Two and a half minutes gone by here in the third. Holiday, the pass to Gaffer. Here's Bembry. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. Yeah, easy call. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And that one misses. They aren't making anything at the line today. This is a team that struggles at the line. That one is no good. Pittsburgh trails by three. Inside. And it's Melly missing. Here's Bembry. White block shot. And Pirtle sends it back. Gotta love the shot blocking ability of Pirtle. Wonderful timing right there. His shot was hindered by that momentous mobile one block. 
Every basket's a big one in a tight game, and he is not about to give up an easy look. Third quarter here, and three minutes have come off the clock. And play stops, whistle on what looks to be an illegal screen. And those are the kinds of mistakes that are magnified when we're talking about a game down the stretch. Now a timeout called by Pittsburgh. And Kevin, he saw his, his guys just a little sluggish out there. Oftentimes a timeout like this allows you to kind of just reset. Keeps going. Three minutes into the second half now. McConnell with it. Uses the glass to finish the layup. McConnell's got six points. Now how about how he sets his man up there, runs him right into the screen, and then gets the basket. Count that one. Man, I'll tell you, when you get your floater game going, it's a tremendous weapon. Pass to McConnell. Back to Dotson. Here's Nader. Pittsburgh working the ball around. To the paint. There's McConnell. And he makes good on the layup. McConnell's got four points in the quarter. Well, check out that assist. That's a pair of teammates that are clearly on the same page. Double team on Holiday. Here's Wilson. A three-pointer off the mark. Dotson kicks to McConnell. Solid play in the low block, and that one's good. He's got 10. The ball movement on this run has been fantastic and is a big part of why they've been able to get these good looks. Passes it to Wilson. A three-pointer, no good. And it's McConnell with the ball. He'll bring it up for Pittsburgh. Pass to Dotson. And it's Pirtle at the elbow to the middle six on the shot clock and that basket's gonna count folks gets the goaltending call right there so close to getting the block there you, you can live with those calls because you'd rather have a guy playing aggressive instead of playing it safe Kyle Anderson he's checked in for Las Vegas Avery Bradley comes in for DeAndre Bembry outside holiday Las Vegas again missing this is the guy who had three threes in the first half. Since then, still waiting on number four. Bertel, the pass to McConnell. Second shot opportunity. Jump shot is good that time. McConnell's got ten points in just the second half. Las Vegas calls timeout. Uh, let's see if Coach can get them back on the right track. Because right now, it feels like the pace is being dictated to them. They need to go back to playing their brand of basketball. Las Vegas trails by five. A holiday. 19 points in the game. No good. They had a chance to end the run there. 
Hard to catch up when you can't hit shots. This is a quarter he liked to forget. A shot by McConnell, no good. Anderson inside, and there's the pass to Wilson. They find Jay on the way, and it's off the back rim, no good. Here's Nader. He's covered by Anderson. Now, here's McConnell. 14 points for him. Hurdle, the pass to Nelly. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. It's going to be on Avery Bradley. This will make four trips to the line so far in the game. Two shots. He's off on the first. Justin Jackson, he's checked in for Aaron Holiday. And the second free throw, good. Las Vegas trails by six. Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time taking the lid off. Bradley, that's for two. And the foul on Daniel Gafford. That's his third foul of the game. One item that stood out, their ball movement. Things are definitely clicking. And more importantly, it makes it really hard to defend. Pass to Melly. Off target from outside. Here's Anderson. He's tightly guarded, and the basket is good. Anderson's got eight points. Working off contact is something Anderson does extremely well, and he does it a lot. Passes it to Dodson. Pittsburgh working the ball around. The V just kind of stepping aside and letting him get to the rim. There's a reason, GA. The lead is what it is right now. It's a backbreaker for your defense, giving up easy buckets like that. Bradley drives in. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Yeah, watching Bradley, not sure exactly how to describe it. There's a quiet burst to the way he moves. Three trips to the line so far for him in this one. At the line for two. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And free throw good from Avery Bradley. Good on both. And here's McConnell. 14 points for him. Pass to Dodson. Here's Nader. The rebound by Anderson. <laughs> and watching Kyle Anderson, Greg Popovich once stated, he's not what you'd call a typical NBA athlete. HGA hit the nickname slow-mo because he plays at a deliberate pace. He has tremendous skills, a high basketball IQ. He has improved defensively. He's a jack-of-all-trades. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That free throw, no good. He's good on the second. Here's Pittsburgh with the ball. They're on an 18 to 7 run. The pass to Purdy. To the wing right side. 
Here's Dotson. The teardrop falls in. Dotson's got seven points for the quarter. In all second half, they haven't gotten stops with any consistency. Here's Anderson, and a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. You saw the talent from day one in summer league. Anderson's one of those guys who can really get it done in a lot of different areas. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Two shots. And he can't get the first one. So for Las Vegas, Stewart's checked in for Daniel Gafford. And Okongwu's subbed in for DJ Wilson. And he sinks the second. Pittsburgh leading by four. And the officials signal the backcourt violation. Not very careful there. Let's check out the Western Conference standings right now that we're here in the new year. You take a look at Las Vegas. Here's Bradley. He's got nine. Outside Jackson. And looks like the illegal pick was set. Yep, that's right. That'll get their attention. This could be a problem. That's his fourth foul with plenty of basketball left to play. McConnell with it. He's got 14. Pass to Nader. And here's McConnell, guarded by Bradley. Passes to Dodson. Just four to shoot. They get it back. And the dunk by Pirtle. Got to be on the lookout for Pirtle crashing the glass, using his body to wreck the defense on the boards. Bradley passes to Anderson. Popped up there for Anderson. Banked in off the glass. Anderson's got 11 points. Beautiful call that time up the floor. The hard screen frees him up for the bunny. Pass to Dodson. Back to McConnell. And the pass to Pirtle. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. And Pirtle using his frame well, drawing the defense into him on his shot. These are his third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. Taking two shots. one is off. And no good on the second free throw. So he goes 0 for 2 there. And the rebound battle split evenly thus far. Jackson misses. Pittsburgh leading by 4. Dots in the pass to Melly. Gets the three-pointer to fall. Melly's got six points in the quarter. Not just a knockdown shooter. He does a great job of finding space for his shot. Jackson passes to Stewart. Outside Brandon. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. He's got 12. Both teams running perimeter-oriented plays that are working. How often do we see this these days? Clubs answering each other from range. Here's Dotson. Good. And McConnell gets the assist. McConnell's got his seventh assist here tonight. This has been a tremendous quarter for him. Everything he puts up now looks like it's going in. Anderson outside. Right at the free throw line. No good on the shot. A bit long that time. Pittsburgh leading by seven. Here's Nader. Boom. He jams it straight down. And just tacks a few more points onto their lead with the tomahawk. Ah, that's bringing it down hard. Jackson dishes to Bradley. 
Stewart passes to Anderson. Kicks to Brandon. But they recover it. Jackson, and he uses the glass on the layup. Jackson's got his first points of the night. Relentless on the offensive glass, and then you love the finish. Here's Dotson. He has 31. Here's Pirtle. Misses the shot. The third quarter comes to a close. Force lead by seven. And don't go away. We'll be back momentarily. And now let's go back to a play from earlier as we show you our State Farm assist of the game. And, you know, you can always count on him for at least a couple of these pretty assists over the course of a game. And this one, a thing of beauty. You see why they trust him with the ball in his hands. He can make the simple play, and he can pull off the spectacular. And this is it. Glad to have you along for this fourth and final quarter. You've got Jakob Hurdle. And it's Dotson in at the two. Pass to Melly. Dotson kicks to Pirtle. Passes it to McConnell. Here's Nader. That one doesn't go. And it's Las Vegas the other way. To the left side wing. Here's Bembry. Pass to Holiday. Double team on Holiday. To the wing on the left. The tray. That's in, and the force lead is cut down to just four points in the bucket from Finney Smith. The defenders need to recognize the importance of staying on him as we get into crunch time. The pass to Melly. Now McConnell. And another one in the scoring column for him. He's 7 of 10 from the field. I don't know what coach told him at halftime, but he is shooting the lights out right now. Pass to Bembry. Here's Finney Smith. Passes it to Okongwu. Pittsburgh pulls it in. Pirtle's got rebound number 12 now. Tenacity on the glass. McConnell passes to Nelly. Pittsburgh working the ball around. Here's Dotson. Here's Pirtle. And he battles for the ball and gets the second chance bucket. And it's an eight-point force lead. Really nice work. Pirtle going to town on the weak defense down in the paint. And breathe the pass to Stewart. It's tipped. And Holiday kicks to Finney Smith. Back to Holiday. And every miss finds its way to his hands. Well, what an impressive performance. And we have to give him props. It's rare these days to see someone dominate the glass so single-handedly. Pass to Finney Smith. To the inside. And breathe the pass to Finney Smith. Here's Stewart, defended by Pirtle. That's in, and the force lead is cut down to seven on the bucket from Finney Smith. He is really shouldering the load on the offensive end and doing an outstanding job, but he needs the rest of his team to step up. Nader kicks to Dotson. Now, here's McConnell, guarded by Holiday. Here's Dotson. Trying to answer back, but that three is off the mark. And so Holiday will bring it up for Las Vegas. So far in the fourth quarter, they've allowed just six points. Here's Bembry. Back to Holiday. From deep three-point range, Finney Smith can't get it to go. Pittsburgh leading by seven. Dots in the pass to Nader. Here's Melly. There's the pass to McConnell. Over Okonwu. 
A shot by McConnell, no good. Las Vegas trails by seven. Here's Finney Smith. Kicks it to Holiday. And it's slammed in by Holiday. Now that's what I call a momentum changer. Yeah, when you've got a point guard with that kind of spring, no lead is safe. You're totally right. That can be a shot in the arm for them. A spark that turns things around. And they call an illegal screen here. Yeah, first turnover of the game. Overall, though, he's been rock solid. And Las Vegas making a change here. Gafford's checked in. Here's Bembry. Pass to Gafford. He dishes it to Holiday. Can't hit from 12. Pittsburgh leading by five. Inside, Dotson. Basket is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. And he has just been in a flow offensively. Terrific game. He has been the X Factor. Here's Holiday. Pass to Okongwu. And Pirtle pulls it down. Pirtle's got 15 rebounds here tonight. Here's Dotson. Can't hit from in close. Las Vegas trails by eight. Outside Holiday. Pass to Finney Smith. With the teardrop. He can't get that one. A force with the ball. Here's Dotson, and he dunks it down. Any chance you get, you want to put yourself in a position to succeed, and that's what he did there. Great job of reading the floor, got to the rim, and made a play. Here's Benbury. Six to shoot. Looking to get it going. No good that time. So Pittsburgh will take it the other way. Here's Dotson. Good. And McConnell gets the assist. McConnell's got 10 assists here tonight. So active. Las Vegas trails by 12. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. Las Vegas calls timeout. Yeah, just looking to tighten up their defense in the paint. They've got to be better. It's a matter of want to. Helping out, contesting shots. You have to want to make the effort. The New Balance Player of the Game. And what an amazing ball game we've seen from him. It's been a one-man show worth the price of admission all by itself. There wasn't anything he couldn't do on that court tonight. And let's catch up with our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. Thanks, guys. I was able to hear Las Vegas' coach talk to his team during the timeout. He got on him. He said he's got to see more intensity. He said, we've put ourselves in this hole, and we've got to work our way out of it. Show me you've got what it takes, guys. Now the pass to Finney Smith. Back to Holiday. And just miss after miss right now. A slight rebound advantage for them. One more column in their favor, and it's all adding up. Pass to Pirtle. Now McConnell. Pocket six. Can't cash in from close range. Outside Holiday. Passes it to Gaffer. 
Yes, and it's Holiday with the assist that time. And he found the soft spot in the D on that possession. McConnell passes to Nader. Here's Dotson. Pass to McConnell. Here's Melly. It's rebounded by Las Vegas. And Holiday has it in the corner. And Okungwu slams it in. And maybe that'll trigger them. Impossible not to get pumped up after that. Yeah, well, you can see the immediate reaction of the guys on the bench. They are pumped up. A shot by Nader, no good. Las Vegas trails by eight. Holiday, the pass to Gaff. And Pirtle sends it back. Now, here's McConnell, guarded by Holiday. Down low, Dotson. No good on the shot, and it's Las Vegas the other way. And Holiday has it in the corner. From outside, off the mark. He has gone ice cold this quarter. Obviously not helping their calls. And the shot is good. So it's Las Vegas now. Here's Bembry. He kicks it to Holiday. The pass to Finney Smith. Here's Gafford on the wing, Holiday. Lets it fly from 18. And right on target with the swish. Holiday's got 23 points. Now that's a high percentage look when the D doesn't fight over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. To the paint, here's Nader. And he goes strong with the one-handed jam. Great player movement, great ball movement. That's fun to watch. And Okongwu has it in the corner. And Pirtle pulls it down. Here's Dotson. And the foul on Dorian Finney Smith. That is his first foul of the game. Stewart's checked in for Las Vegas. Now a timeout called by Pittsburgh. They're ahead by 10. 153 left in the fourth. Pittsburgh with the possession here. It's a 10-point game. Shot clock at six. Doubled by Okongwu. On the three off target. Out of bounds. Possession goes to the force. Pittsburgh leading by 10. McConnell passes to Melly. And it's good, two points. Yeah, how about that one? Able to maintain control and finish the play. Holiday who will bring it up for Las Vegas. Trailing by 13. Launches a three, and Finney Smith gets it to go. Great timing. That can be the difference between an assist and a turnover. Pass to McConnell. Shot 
just five to shoot. Here's Nader. Over to the left wing. Bembry. It's good on the putback. Stewart's got it back down to single digits for Las Vegas. The uncanny ability to time the tip in. He does this night in and night out. Passes to Dotson. Now, here's McConnell. He's guarded closely. Takes a shot at the elbow. It's rebounded by Las Vegas. Guys, let's just go ahead and call this one. It's over. They couldn't make enough plays when it mattered. Interesting game, though, in terms of some of the matchups. Substitution on the court. Sixteen seconds left in the fourth quarter. Now, here's Joseph. So it's Pittsburgh picking up the win. Some good moments throughout this one, but they have the clear advantage down the stretch. Yeah, I mean, I, I love the way they executed on both ends of the floor, completely under control for the vast majority of the game. And whenever there was a misstep, they just didn't allow it to fester. And that's why they're going to walk away with the win. And that about wraps it up for David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, and Steve Smith, and the rest of our terrific 2K Sports crew. This is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. We'll see you later.